podcasting is the new blogging. That's what Seth Godin said at the end of 2018. And this is the same Seth who has been blogging daily for more than a decade. So Seth was there in the early days when blogging was just taking off and he recognizes the same phenomena today. Despite the booming industry around the business of podcasting, there are less than a million active podcasts today, just over 700,000. Compare that to half a billion active blogs. So if you have a message to share, now is the time to share it and you might wanna consider a podcast. 2019 was a pivotal year in the rise of podcasting as a mainstream content medium. And that's because the US has crossed into saturation territory where 51% of people, more than half, have now listened to at least one podcast and 22% say they listen weekly. Internationally, there are now podcasts in a hundred different languages. So 2019 was also the first full year where Google Podcasts became a standalone app and Apple officially announced they were sunsetting iTunes and investing heavily into Apple Podcasts as a standalone platform. Google and Apple dominate today's technology, but they're not alone in the podcasting rush. Spotify just paid $340 million to acquire two podcast startups, and Pandora has podcasts now too. If podcasting is the new blogging, then now is the time to become an early adopter and get in.